by the time when you started this, um, there are no other film festivals here, I think, is it? And uh, not that I'm aware of. Yeah, because yeah, the the way you project it, you know, the the festival mode you created. Now it's a very a very big event in uh, Melbourne, which is uh, recognized by across the world as well. Before uh, before starting this kind of IFFM, uh, like you know, film festivals, what kind of thought process you felt? Film festival and you know distribution is uh, integration of both. You know, how did you make effective? How did you make it effective that you know everyone comes to a theater and watch? Did did you ever face any challenges with the piracy? Because uh, we face piracy is a living, constant nightmare. Hmm. Not only for the film distributors or festival directors, but for everyone who is. Uh, remotely related to the arts, uh, remotely related to filmmaking and also whether we realize it or not, it also affects pretty much everyone because um, uh, a lot of piracy, the money that comes for piracy funds terrorism, it funds um, a lot of um, mafia. So th there is a lot of dark elements attached to piracy which we probably don't even think about. Oh. You know, So that's why um, uh, it's a constant challenge not only for a very small distributor like me mm. but pretty much for everyone.